What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Crystal Walkthrough. Okay, so we're back here in Goldenrod City because there is a little something that I want to do before we move forward in Mahogany, Tin or Mahogany City or Town or whatever it is. Um, we did see um, Bill in the... In in, in the in the Pokemon Center over there in Mahogany Town or whatever I don't know I'm a little sleepy right now guys I'm very sorry but yes we found him over there now we can come here and do this you see him right here he's like hey, hi Draven do us a favor and take this Eevee it came I came it came over when I was uh, adjusting a time capsule someone has to take care of it but I don't like being outside can I count on you uh, to play with it yeah, sure, why not? I knew you'd come through. Way to go. You're the real deal. Okay, I'm counting on you. Stop talking and just give me the Pokemon. So here we have our next Pokemon right here. Eevee. That's right. And, uh... Well, it's got... It, it has to get a nickname because, yes, I will be using this Eevee on my team. Hmm. What's a good nickname? I'm, like, doing this right off the bat right now. Um, let's see... Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. You know what? What is a very, very good nickname for this one? I'm like literally trying to figure out a good nickname for a psychic type Pokemon because, yes, I will be evolving this Eevee into an Espeon. I know many of you guys want to see Ombreon, but I'm leaning towards Espeon right here. So, let's see. Espeon. Hmm. Hmm. You know what? I am going to reserve that until it finally evolves. I should probably do that. Hold on. Hmm. Trying to figure it out. Stay with me in just a little bit, guys. Uh, I'm going to move forward to Mahogany Town. You guys will see the nickname in just a little bit. Okay, so after a few minutes of thinking of what Pokemon... Well, what nickname... Would be good for my Eevee. I came down with this. It is Relic. I like the nickname. I don't care what anybody says. So go. Yeah, you guys know what to do. Go screw yourselves if you don't like it. I'm just playing. So as you can see, Relic with the K, Eevee, normal type Pokemon, level 20. It's male. That's right. Tackle, Tail Whip, Sam, Attack, and Growl. And its level or its uh, its stats are evened out and all that stuff. Now. Eevee in the second generation can actually evolve into, eh, you know, it can evolve into five different types of Pokemon now. Three of those Pokemon are through Elemental Stones, the Fire Stone, elect or Lightning Stone, and Water Stone, yes. You do that, you'll get Flareon, Jelchion, Vaporeon, those Pokemon. Now, right here, I've already, I've already told you guys that my intention is to evolve my Eevee into an Espeon. Now, there's two ways of evolving this Pokemon into Espeon or into Ombreon. Espeon, of course, you have to have high friendship and you have to uh, evolve it in the daytime. Ombreon, high friendship, nighttime. And that is exactly what we're going to be doing for the next few days. I'm actually going to be taking SP or I'm going to be taking Eevee to the uh, hair salon. And I'm going to keep on uh, trying to increase its friendship. Now, I'm going to try and prevent it from fainting too because that's a big knock if you, if you faint your Pokemon. They will not like you. Now, the other Pokemon here that actually needs a little bit more friendship too is Toxic Batman as well. Because it barely evolved into a, into a Golbat. I've had it for, the, for quite, a time, quite some time. So it might... Might evolve into a Golbat sooner than, than you guys think right here. So now, here we are in Ecrotech uh, City. I've checked it. And uh, this is a very, very historical place right here. This is where the, the whole story just, you know, centers itself to. It is, uh, you know, home to the two towers that we will be eventually going to. Now, go right here. Talk to this guy. He's like, ah, you're on an adventure with your Pokemon. Well, what's an adventure without treasure hunting? Am I right or am I right? I think you're wrong. I'm like, yeah? Good. You understand the true spirit of adventure. I think, or I like that. Take this with you. We get ourselves the item finder, which, you know, it's a very good item to find some hidden items right here. There are many hidden, uh, there are many, many items lying about that aren't obvious. Use the item finder to check, uh, check it out in the, an item on the ground near to you and you of course I'm like not reading this correctly it doesn't show exactly the exact spot so you'll have to look yourself 
Oh, yeah, I heard that there's a, are, there are items in the Architect Burnt Tower, which is one of the towers that we will be going to. Of course, as you can see right here, this is the uh, Ecrotech City Gym, and if you go in here, it's like, Morty the Gym Leader is absent. Sorry, but you're gonna have to leave. Woohoo! And he pushes me back. Wow. Thanks, asshole! So, we can't do any gym battles right now. Um, we can talk to the locals right here. He's like, I heard a rumor. I heard a rumor about Olivine Lighthouse. The Pokemon that serves as the beacon fell ill. Sounds like they are in trouble. Huh. Okay. And if you go right here, talk to this guy. He's like, this happened when I was young. The sky suddenly turned black. A giant flying Pokemon was blocking out the sun. I wonder what that Pokemon was. It was like a bird and a dragon. Hmm. Okay. And this guy is like, is there really a Pokemon that big? If it, if it exists, it must be powerful. Probably is. Again, this is the, the place where everything starts coming together when it comes to the legend. And if you go right here, Ecotech City, a historical city where the past meets the present. Hmm. Talk to this guy, he's like, ah, child, you have learned to dance like the Kimono Girls? If you go... In if you go to their dance th theater, an odd old man will give you something nice, I hear. Hmm. Probably. So this is the kimono, uh, the, the, the dance theater right here. That's one place that you can go to. Talk to this guy. He's like, Ecotec used to have two towers. One on the east, one on the west. Hmm. As you can see, this is, well, not this one right here. If you go right here, let's talk to this guy first. I hear Pokemon are rampaging at the Lake of Rage. I'd like to see that. Okay, well, that's another clue that there's a lot of stuff going on now. If you go right here. Burnt Tower. It was destroyed by a mysterious fire. Please stay away as it is unsafe. Okay. Talk to this girl. He's like, the tower that used to be here, my grandma told me, it used to, have much, uh, used to be much taller. So, our first adventure right here is the Burnt Tower. Now, Pokemon Gold and Silver... The tower won't look like this at all. It really won't. Now, that's why I like the detail on this thing right here. Um, let's see. Let me check out this part right here. Now, the other tower is in this area, in this location right here. Now, if you go in here, this guy is quick enough to not let you through. Look at that. He's... Wow, he... Okay, what if I juke you? I can't juke you on this one. So, talk to this guy. He's like, the tin tower is off limits to anyone without an Ecrotech City gym badge. Sorry, but you'll have to leave. Flipping you off, bro. Flipping you off. Okay, so our first our first task will be right here at the Burnt Tower. Now, there is something that I need to do because there are there is something there that, you know, needs to be taken care of. Now, we, I, we did pick up Rock Smash in the last episode. So I'm going to teach that to somebody right here. Now, remember, it's not the only Rock Smash attack that you'll, you'll find here in Pokemon Crystal. You can actually buy it at Goldenrod City. So... I am going to give it to, I think I should give it to, you know what, I'm going to give it to Cinder right here. Okay. Cinder will, hmm. Fury Cutter was really good to me. You know what, I'm going to take away Smoke Screen and really don't use that much Smoke Screen, but here it is, Rock Smash. And, uh, let's see. Probably should keep Relic there. You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna push Kit Thunder up top because you know what? we're gonna be doing some switch training right here. So let's go inside the burnt tower right here. Now once you get in, somebody's gonna notice you right now. He's like, You seen? My name is You Seen. I'm on the trail of a Pokemon named Suicune. And you are? Draven, glad to meet you. I heard rumors that Suicune is in this burnt tower, so I came to look. But where, is it? Where, could, where exactly could it be? Hmm. Okay. I don't know. And uh, would you look at that? Huh. Now, if you go right here, he's like, Ecrotex, uh, or a uh, gym leader has to study what are or what are said to be the legendary Pokemon Suicune, Entei, and Raikou. You've seen his years, so I've decided to investigate the tower with him. So this is Morty, the gym leader. He's you know, investigating some kind of stuff right here. Now, as you can see, we need Rock Smash for this part right here. So I'm going to use it. Cinder, use Rock Smash. Look at that. And we will get some items right here, which is the HP up. 
I could use that for a Pokemon, but I could sell that too for a very, very high price too. And then, uh, let's see. Anywhere else. Any oh, wow. And yes, you will be able to find some Pokemon right here. I think at night you will be able to find Ghastlies. I think Magmars you can... You can actually find Magmars right here too. I want to I want to say yes. So we're going to escape that. And of course, as you can see, our rival's right there waiting for us. So let's uh, go ahead and beat the crap out of this guy right here. So he notices us right away. Oh, it's you. I came looking for some legendary Pokemon that they uh, say Roos here. But there's nothing here. Nothing after all the trouble of coming to this dump. No way. It's all your fault. Hmm. This guy has a really big problem with, like, blaming people for his mistakes. I don't know. So here we go. Silver wants the battle, and he is going to be sending out his Haunter. Wow. This is new. So I'm going to go with Kid Thunder right here. Kid Thunder is going to be cursed. But the advantage is that Haunter just uh, took, uh, took away half his HP right here. Okay, I can deal with a little bit of a curse right now. I can. So I'm going to go again with another Thunder Punch. Hopefully I don't get paralyzed right here. And that is a critical hit. But hopefully this will win it. And it does. Goodbye. And look at that. Kid Thunder's just like doing things on her own. Look at that. Good for you. And trying to learn Light Screen, which is a very good move right here. So I'm going to teach that. And special attacks will not be that effective anymore. So let's. Oh, he's got a Magnemite, so I gotta switch this up right here. So let's go to Lucky. Mm hmm. Things have changed since the last battle. I think the last battle I was a little. Like, I was struggling. Just a little bit, I don't know. So here we go. Mud Slap. Hopefully for that win. But there's that Sonic Boom. Oh, God. You do not like me. And there we go. One hit KO onto that Magnemite. Oh, yeah. Oh, and almost grows a level right there. Coming out with a Zubat. You know what? I should go back to Kit Thunder right there. But you know what? I'm going to go to Toxie. Uh, Toxie, uh, what should I call him? My Toxie Batman. You know? I'm going to show him what a real Golbat looks like. Or I just went to Cinder. Just not knowing it. Um, Amber Attack. Burn the crap out of it. And, uh, did it? No. Wow, that's supersonic. Wow. Why did you not switch that supersonic for Confuse Ray? I I'm wondering. I am wondering. But here we go, another Ember attack. And that will give us a victory against this guy right here. Heck yes. Look at that. Flexing our muscles just a little. And here he comes out with his Crocona. I'm going to switch this up to... Hmm. Let's go to Teddy. Teddy, has Teddy needs some work right here. Look at this guy. Looks beefy, looks ready to fight, but guess what? Teddy is too. Battle of the cute Pokemon. Coming back to you. And uh, there's that water attack. Wow, water gun attack. Oh, jeez. So here we go. Headbutt attack. Takes a nice amount. But you know what? Let's go with that rollout. Should have started with that. Probably should have started with that right there. So here we go. Rollout attack. And that doesn't do much, but Crocodile is just, you know, going ham on us. But here we go again with another rollout. Takes a little bit more. And here comes another water gun. Hopefully that doesn't make us faint here. And here we go again with the rollout. And that seals the win. Look at that. Teddy grows to level 30 or 22. That's also good in it. Wow, it's learning faint attack. A very good move right here. So I'm going to switch up another move which is Scratch. And believe it or not, guys, Faint Attack cannot miss. And it is a Dark-type move, too. So it's actually helping us out right here for because we're going to be facing a Ghost-type Gym Leader. Hmm. This is the way... This is why I hate battling Wimps. Dude, you are... You are... Wow, wow. There's no challenge in it. Seriously, how is there no challenge in it? You did not beat us, you a-hole. He's like, oh, whatever. You would never be able to catch a legendary Pokemon anyway. And then, next thing you know it, we fall into a hole. Huh. What are you doing falling into a hole? Some genius you are. Serves you right. 
Wow. This guy, this guy absolutely hates us. So after that battle, here we are in another, another, another section of the uh, burnt tower. And uh, first is first. Oh, there's a. Yeah, we need strength for that one. I did not realize that. Okay, so did not want to me mess with that. Okay, so I'm gonna go away because I don't need to battle Raditz right here. But once you go into this area right here. Yeah, there's going to be some Pokemon just bugging the crap out of you. I probably should turn on a fa uh, Repel. Yeah, I'm probably going to get a Repel. I'm going to get a Repel. Okay, you know what? First, I'm going to go like this. Kit Thunder, switch to Relic. And... Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Let's get that Repel going. Okay, so we, we're good for 100 steps. And as you can see, there are some sleeping Pokemon right there. There are three of those guys. And I'm trying to look. Okay, so there's items right there. Okay, so once you get down here in this section, go up here. And next thing you know, it, all three of the legendary dogs or legendary beasts will be waking up right here. Both Raikou and Entei will be running away. But Suicune will be looking at you and it's going to keep an eye out for you. So from here on out, you and Suicune are connected in some way. And, uh, wow, Yusin is not going to let this go. It's like, I dug a hole here, too. I was shocked. Suicune raced by like a blur, right in front of my eyes. For 10 years, I chased Suicune, and I finally got to see it. I'm all choked up. Draven, I owe, I owe, I owe this all to you. Thank you. I heard that the legendary Pokemon of Ecrotech has chosen humans by allowing them to get close. I'm going to track. Uh, I'm going to track Suicune. Draven, let us meet again. Farewell. So from here on out, you will be seeing. Uh, you know, you'll 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 see Suicune here and there. And uh, guess that's it for this area right here. Now, once everything's done, this old man will appear, and he's like. In a distant pass, this tower, this tower burned in a, in a fire. Three nameless Pokemon perished in it. A rainbow-colored Pokemon descended from the sky and resurrected them. It's a legend that has been passed down from by the Ecotech gym leaders. Me? I was once a trainer back then. Hmm. Yeah, this guy used to be the gym leader of the Ecotech City gym, so. That's one thing down, and we got another thing to go, and, uh, well, we could go to the gym, but, you know what, I'm gonna save that for another episode right here, we're gonna stay tuned, I'm gonna try and get, I'm gonna try and get my, uh, my Eevee to evolve into an Espeon very, very quickly here, guys, but in the next episode, we will be going to the Kimono Girls, because there's something there that we need in order to defeat Morty in the next gym battle, so, stay tuned, guys. I'll be back tomorrow for another episode of Pokemon Crystal. See you guys.